What a lovely way to start the morning. I don't know if you could see, but this person has Give Peace a Chance on the back of their car, which, what a lovely, lovely thing to put on your car. Um, it's 9.42, and I'm on my way to uh, the dentist. Nothing major, just a checkup. I'm here, I'm at the, the dentist. Wish me luck. Um, it's just a checkup, but I know that he's gonna be, um, I'm sorry, it's a tooth cleaning, but I know that he'll be checking my teeth to see if I have any cavities, so I really hope I don't. Um, but apparently I have tartar buildup, which is not good. So, that's it. More news in, well for you guys, just in a few seconds, but for me in about an hour. I'm heading to Walmart um, because I have some film to be printed, like back in the good old days when we did not have digital cameras. Um, yeah, and we actually took pictures and we didn't know what they looked like until they were printed and it was all exciting to go back and get them. Well, yeah, I'm about to relive that. These are. I love it when people don't look where they're driving. I was about to get run over. So yeah, this is film from back in the day and there are pictures on this that I haven't seen that I've actually lost. And I've been looking for this roll and thank God I am a pack rat and I just keep everything. So hopefully they'll be able to print it at this Walmart. I made it to work um, and my teeth are fine. I'm very excited. I don't have any cavities. Um, we just did a cleaning and I got a bunch of freebies. Check it out. Oh, I'm not even gonna throw them out, but it's a bunch of, um, it's a toothbrush and a bunch of toothpaste, which is really good because they're travel size and it'll be good for when I leave because I'm traveling this week. Um, and I also have my boots that I need to fix and get these boots cleaned up. So that's it. Um, I'm actually running late. I technically start at, um, 10 o'clock, but it's now 11.30. So, good thing I don't have really anyone to answer to, technically. And I've already advised everyone that I will be late. So that's it, folks. I'm really excited. I actually have been looking for a jewelry box or a place to like stash my jewelry, not just a box. And uh, there's a store here and that I know carries stuff like that, because I've owned one from them before. And there's a huge sale sign on it, so. Hopefully there's like some, oh, I hate this. It's like ice. Um, so yeah, I'm hoping I can like score some good discounts. Not like nicely finished wood. Here's this one. This is nine. Oh, and there's more boxes here. That was unsuccessful. I saw um there's one of them in the video, I think you'll see it's it was five ninety-nine and it's all MDF, I thought it was wood, it's not. It's MDF, which is, you know, poor quality. If you looked it up close, it's poor craftsmanship, and it was about $350. Um, and we pay sales tax here, so it would have probably been around like $380, which is, I think, a little bit ridiculous for a spur of the moment purchase on something that's not such great quality. So, that was a bust. Back to work we go. Can I get cash back, please? It'll ask you. It'll ask you. Oh, okay. Uh, 
26 over here, please. Is that good? Set the slide over here. Ah non, il est rentré à 10 heures. Ouais. Il est jeune, il faut le On va te laisser à 8 heures. Je vais t'en aller seul. D'accord. Je veux juste tes initiales pour le tasse. Merci. 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 Happy New Year. Merci beaucoup. Mon pauvre ami, c'est bien. So I got the pictures. I'm so excited to see how they turned out. I'm having a moment right now because I just looked over the pictures and I just can't believe <sighs> the pictures are from about seven years ago when I was living in Cairo, Egypt and um, those uh, pictures of um, a certain someone that I was crazy about back then and I lost the pictures of him and I and I'm one of those people who likes to keep pictures for memory's sake and I really thought I would see these pictures and feel this flood of emotion and I felt absolutely nothing. I felt absolutely nothing which is shocking to me and it just makes me wonder if really time does heal all wounds or if you know we just have our own coping strategies with emotional dilemmas, you know what I mean? Anyways, I have to say that things are good and I'm really happy and I just feel really, really blessed right now.